You are a Clipper fan, if I'm yep. not mistaken. Yeah, How did you get into the Clippers? It's a tough go. It's been a tough <laughs> go for me, man. That's uh, T.J. Jefferson over your right shoulder is uh, another. There we go. Uh, a cell, a Clipper s- Nation. Afflicted. There's the other one. So I found him. Because you're from Nebraska, correct? Yeah. So, all right. Yeah, and, I've been out here. I've been in, in L.A. for like, uh, with like 20 years now. But you have your choice when you come out here. Uh, you know I, what I mean? I did, yeah. But I couldn't afford... Laker tickets. Is that, is yeah. that yeah. basically and it? I, lo- I mean, I love Shaq and Kobe. They were the best sure. when I first moved here. But uh, I couldn't afford those tickets. So I would get like the $7 ticket. I'd sit way up in the nosebleeds. And then no one was at those games. So they were like, mm-hmm, it doesn't matter. Come on down. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'd get to in like the 100 or 200 section. So... Uh, who were on those teams? Do you remember? Who was, who was the stars yeah, was of like, those teams when you first started going to Clipper games? Like... Uh, like um, is it Olo Olo Candy still here? I'm trying to figure out. Twenty it was years Elton ago, Brand Elton Brand and, and those, okay, those guys. McGetty, Corey yeah, Maggetti. Corey McGetty. Yeah. Okay, mm-hmm. right. and Richardson. then and then once I started to make money and could buy good tickets, yes. uh, that was like the Lob City days. So then then I got season tickets. I had them for almost a decade and yeah. just just gave them up last year. You gave them up? Yeah. Well, I was gone. I was I was working okay. out of town so much. Right. And I just couldn't make it to any games. And uh, yeah, it sucks. I, I really miss it. Do you ever have a, a meeting with Bomber or any any conversation with him? Any any yeah, face to face? Yeah, I was at a like I was at a bar once, and it was like a, for the NBA awards. Okay. And he came up to me, and he was just like the coolest. Just like, hey man, oh I see you at the games. What do you think <laughs> of my trades? Because he had just like gotten he kind of blown up the team, gotten rid of Blake Griffin, mm-hmm. and I like know Blake I really like Blake and I'm like well we'll have to see about that <laughs> I'm like trying to flex on Balmer I'm like I'm like oh, well we'll see if you know what you're doing or not uh and I it turns out he he kind of did but uh yeah. but it still hasn't panned out Balmer get it together bud get it together we need a championship yeah, he's got they're building that new spot yeah they right? are so okay can they get you back you think or what well I just gotta quit I my, my career needs to take a dip yeah. <laughs> Once my career goes in the toilet, you'll be seeing me at a lot more games, is what I'm saying. Oh my gosh. Toilet. There it is. That's uh, that, that's Balmer screaming about his toilets in his new facility. Catch the Rich Eisen show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern for free.